Okay, so let's talk about what we're going to talk about. story. You're a beautiful, powerful, and mighty woman of God, and I love you. Thank you so much. You're confident, yeah. And I think you get away. We know that you can do it. You can go away. Get off of your throne and say, here, sit in my happy throne. I'll sit next to you and cheer you up. Good job. I want to shake your hand. Everybody say, I'm a superhero. Everybody say, I'm a role model. Thank you for that. I love you. Bye. Share those happy thoughts with other people so they can be joyful too. Do you know what a diary is? Yeah. A diary is a book where there's no writing on the pages. It's just blank. And you get to be the author. And the author is the person who writes in the book. So let's all go home today and write in our journal happy and joyful thoughts. Everybody say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Say we love you. We love you. Okay, princesses, now, whenever you're finished with something at the table, you don't destroy your stuff. <laughs> All right, so it, guess what time it is? Princess devotion time, so let's get our lesson from Jesus. How about... Daniel in the lion's den. Oh, yes. Now, think about this. If you are standing in a room that they call a den full of lions, like would that. you be scared? Yes. I'll like, be just okay. closing my eyes and just say to God, I want to get bit. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and if you say to God, I don't want to be bit by these lions, <laughs> he will hear you and he'll protect you. He had his eyes fixed up towards heaven where he knows God is living. And Jesus. And Jesus. And they were shining a light down on him and he stood in the light and he felt protected and safe. And that's how we have to go through each and every day when we feel scared about anything. Let's pretend that's, <laughs> our, that's the shining light shining. <laughs> Until our personal rapture happens, we need to do as much as we can for the world where we teach all of our kids are present, be humble, and be kind. But the Lord is good, and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations. Uh, it worked out very nicely for her to be here tonight. So, Christina Godwin, if you want to come on up to the stage and say, Welcome, Christina. God, if this has happened, you've got a plan and a purpose in this. Use my life wherever I am. And that's what she's doing tonight. So. My life now is not about my bragging rights, my resume, and my credentials. My life is not about Christina the dancer. My life is about how much I love God. He's my mentor. He is who I look up to. He's my best friend. And he's my savior. God says, hey, don't work so hard for that friendship. I didn't put that person in your story. Part of a Christina's Dance World website. Um, for my dance studio, and our motto is be present, be humble, and be kind. But the velvet slide, I call that the velvet slide because it felt good going down. I live on this earth now to tell everyone I possibly can how good God is. And my gift.
God to be able to do my job well and enjoy my career, I did wholeheartedly. And I just loved my life, but I didn't know how to love Jesus. You know what? I just woke up one day and forgot all about him. The ways of this world became my idols. That's easy to do, right? So anyway, I'm in Christina Padalita's God, and I like to say my last name, my maiden name, because I'm from St. Simon's, born and raised here. Raise your hand if we know each other. Sweet. And the rest of you, raise your hand. You don't know me at all? Oh. <laughs> now, some of you didn't raise your hand at all. <laughs> what does that mean? You don't want to acknowledge that you know me? So, why are you laughing at me now? I thought I was doing well. <laughs> you are. 